gentlemen, good evening. I am Mike Nelson from Channel 7, and I am delighted and honored to be your master of ceremonies as Kemp takes Manhattan. It was entirely fitting that as my wife Cindy and I drove down here tonight for the event, we were caught in Manhattan-style traffic on I-25. Stop and go the whole way. Tonight's event is all about kids and helping kids to have the kind of childhood that a child should have, which is a comfortable, safe childhood that they can look back on and remember fondly. The kids are our true gems in our community, and uh, the Kemp Foundation over the years has done so much to ensure that kids have a safe and proper childhood, free from abuse, and uh, a childhood that they can look back upon and, and remember fondly. It's such an honor for George and I to have been asked to be co-chairs of this event tonight, and we're really thrilled to be here. As I look out and during the pre-function, I saw all your gorgeous faces. I can't tell you how blown away I am by this crowd tonight, and you know that. This is, um, this is serious here. We are just absolutely blown away to see so many people supporting us tonight and choosing Kemp, and hopefully we, you'll learn more about Kemp, who does incredible work in the field of child abuse and neglect, in which many of you know, who know me, it touches my heart deeply. We have a faculty of renowned experts who work daily with remarkable compassion, with incredible conviction and integrity to provide hope, and to provide healing to the children and their families that we serve. And I'm very proud to be both their colleague and the current leader of a, such a wonderful group of faculty and an amazing organization. Henry Kemp was a pediatrician and his wife Ruth were, were actually our first faculty pioneers over 40 years ago here in Denver. And we are very proud and honored to walk in their legacy. To be recognized this evening with such distinguished community leaders as Governor Bill Ritter, First Lady Jeannie Ritter, and Walt Imhoff is an honor in itself. Thank you. Georgia Imhoff was the first person to introduce me to the World of Camp Children's Foundation. I moved here almost 25 years ago and it seems like just yesterday, I was a camp volunteer at the Little Brown House on Oneida Street. 5,000, anybody, 5,000, we're at 45, there's five in the back. Now you gotta be 5,500. 5,500 here, gonna be 55. 5,000 in the back, 5,500, gonna go on 55. 55, gonna be on 5,500, gonna be on 55. 5,000, 55, sold at $5,000 over here. I uh, have the honor of, um, uh, introducing our tribute uh, part of the evening tonight. Um, sadly, we lost uh, one of our dearest friends and champions of camp, uh, Georgia Imhoff, who passed away last fall. And this is the first uh, public opportunity uh, Kemp has had to pay tribute uh, to uh, an amazing woman. And uh, Georgia Imhoff served on the Kemp Board of Directors for over a quarter of a century. It's a long time, quarter of a century, yeah. Uh, as chair of the Kemp Foundation Board, I'm honored to be able to say a few words about Georgia, and I'm humbled by the unselfish legacy she leaves behind. When I last saw Georgia at a Kemp fundraiser this past August, she grasped me by my forearm and looked into my eyes and said, Oh, you're going to do so well. I know now that she meant that I was going to do well for children. She desired this not only of me, but of all of you here tonight and of our community at large. This room filled to capacity would have made her oh so joyous and grateful. And we are all grateful for your attendance. In the past, Kemp has always, has always presented an award to a deserving community leader and Kemp supporter at this event. 
And I'm sure it comes as no surprise to any of you that both Walt and Georgia have received that award independently. It's wonderful to be here this evening for this tribute to our very dear friend, Georgia M. Hoff, to honor her, a very deeply spiritual woman who gave and gave and gave for Kemp and the children. And so tonight, Walt, we would like to present you with a gift from the Foundation and the Kemp Alliance. It's a hard knock life for us. It's a hard knock life for us. Dad and treat it. We get tricks. Dad and kiss that. We get cakes. It's a hard knock life. Got no folks to speak of, so it's a hard knock I dreamed last night I got on the boat to heaven And by some chance I had brought my dice along And there I stood And I hollered, someone fade me But the passengers, they know right from wrong for the people said, sit down, sit down, you're rocking the boat. People all said, sit down, sit down, you're rocking the boat. And the devil will drag you under by the sharp lapel of your checkered coat. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down, you're rocking the boat. Run, freedom, run. Freedom, run away. My friends, you gotta run, 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 run. Freedom, run away. That freedom sun will shine someday. Till then, you better run, 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 run. Freedom, run away. I'm frightened. As well, you should be. Freedom is scary. It's a blast of cool wind that burns your face to wake you up. Literally? Yes. And I'm a genius, genius. I believe in God. And I believe that God believes in God. That's me. That's me. That's me. 